good news for anyone who's tired of fishing for their cell phone in their purse or pocket. The latest hot gadget is one you can wear. In Berlin today, Samsung unveiled the Galaxy Gear. Gear is seamlessly connected to the Galaxy smartphone in your pocket. When I receive a phone call, all I have to do is raise my hand to my ear. The device features a metal face, a rubber wristband, and a touch screen. Swipe down to activate the built-in camera, which lets you snap still images and 10-second videos. Swipe across to access notifications, the photo gallery, a pedometer, and apps. 70 apps will be available when the Galaxy Gear launches. Not to be left out, Sony announced a release date for its smartwatch 2, which was first introduced earlier this summer. The sleek aluminum timepiece with its 1.6-inch touchscreen display releases later this month. And Qualcomm introduced its $300 Talk smartwatch and is already taking pre-orders. Timing is everything, especially in tech. The smartwatch announcements come just days before Apple unveils its latest products, though the rumored iWatch isn't expected until next year. And when it does arrive, it will likely be an accessory for your iPhone, not a replacement. There's a lot of reasons for that. If you look at something like a phone, uh, you get a lot of space for a battery, you get a lot of space for very high-tech electronics, big processors, big memory. Uh, camera modules, all that stuff takes up a lot of space. Microsoft, Google, and Dell are reportedly all working on watches that adopt the same strategy, creating a companion device for your smartphone. The market for high-tech timepieces is getting crowded quickly. The popular $150 Pebble has been selling at Best Buy since July. This waterproof watch works with both Apple and Android phones. PHTL's $170 hot watch sports a built-in microphone and speaker, creating a virtual headset. Adding to the cool factor, gesture controls, so users can end a call by waving goodbye. But if you're looking for luxury, the Swiss-made crossbow has you covered. It boasts a 41-megapixel camera. With all the competition for the real estate on your wrist, you may be checking your watch as religiously as your phone in no time. Just a moment. I just got a message. In San Francisco, I'm Simi Das, CNET.com for CBS News.